Hey, what's happening? How you doing? Oh, I heard it when I was up on Facing Street. But um, they said it's on Cunningham Street somewhere. I'm not too sure where. I heard it from up there. Everybody's up here on Cunningham Street. It was like 20 rounds that just went off. Um, not too sure what they were shooting at or who was shooting. Let's take a quick walk over to Cunningham Street, see what's going on. Like I said, not too sure what took place, but uh, let's go see what's going on over here. Let's take a... Must be a full moon today because there's so much activity going on. Like I said, not too sure what's going on here. Let's see. See what we got. Charlie, pull up. Pull up. It's over the uh, fire department, 30 Fremont Street. Uh, it's coming in, uh, possibly smoke from the school there. Uh, Like I said, it's kind of hard to tell what transpired here, but we're trying to see if we can sort it out. <clears throat> Take a quick... For the USF on coming in, we do have a witness stating that um, around the time the shots were fired, there was a gray Honda sedan that fled the wrong way at Cunningham. More information about the occupants. Great Honda sedan seeing the wrong way on Cunningham. Runway 14. Could the operator of the 9511 move his vehicle so we can get out of this uh, street? How you doing, buddy? Good, how are you? All right. It's kind of hard to say what transpired, but definitely was shots fired. Operation Charlie Toto. Two two. It's probably a domestic coming in, 17 Exxon Street. Calls me a mom just attacked her. The uh, caller's pregnant. We got ballistics on Cunningham. They seem to get ballistics on Cunningham. They seem to 
Mm. Must be in that alleyway. Well, we're for the operator 9511. Move your vehicle so we can get out of the bottom lake. Sir, I'm five seconds out. Uh, I'm not too sure what took place, but uh, it, was, it, was, it was quite a bit of rounds that went off, so. Uh, looks like they got some ballistic evidence over there. Not too sure, like what took place, but Boston police been chasing after um, shot so, fire calls. Yeah, so yeah. it's um for the fire fire department's uh setting nothing shown up. I'm out of Robert, it's one to identify I'm gonna take out the fire department So we're not too sure, like, what they were shooting at. Uh, but we do know there is ballistic evidence over there. Not too sure, like, what took place. This is like a typical, this is what a typical day in the city is like. Try 
Bravo 802. 802. High number for Cunningham. High number 212-059-068. Sorry, last three again. Last three, zero, six, eight. Okay, I'll start a new change. Charlie 202 is going to voicemail. Charlie 454, can you tell us about the nature? I know, right? Anyway. <laughs> 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 What's going on, my man? How you doing? Have a night. All right. So, Boston, please respond to another. Uh, another shot fires call. This. This one seemed like it's about 20 rounds. Um, it's it's weird how these this street is not even um, doesn't even have the proper signage on there. I was trying to look for the sign that says Cunningham, but I don't even see the sign. Um, there's there's no sign that says there's no street sign that says Cunningham. But this is Cunningham Street. Alright, Charlie, go three. Do you want to second another? Um, once again, Boston Police responded to a. Yeah, Marty Mira, 86 American. Oh, yeah. Hey, how's it going? going? Alrighty. We got a lot of stuff going on in the city today. A lot of stuff. I guess, I guess you call this the calm before the storm. Uh. So they're gonna gather the ballistic evidence and go from there. <clears throat> I don't think so. Maybe a window or so. Allegedly, um, there was a gray sedan that was seen going up the one-way street. I'm not sure if it was tied into this or not. I think it was a gray four-door sedan. I'm not too sure of the make.
You know, just as quick as they clear this call, they be responding to another call. So, so far, this is the fourth call they had within, let's say, two hours. <clears throat> they probably well, it's kind of hard to tell which way they were shooting and it's, it's tough to see stuff at night it's tough to see at night though it's very tough No, they do a good job checking, but it's always something you miss because it's, it's tough to see everything. You just got to try to figure which way they were, which way they were aiming too. Uh, 15 Whitman Street. We got more shots fired. 15 Whitman, uh, one round there. Yeah, There's always something going on. I don't know. I guess there's just too many guns on the street. That's that's one thing. Anybody out there that can clear for that shot spotter? 15 Whitman. guys just want to show you what goes on in the city um they, they're going to con collect the evidence more likely there'd be the other stuff that would surface up Too sure which direction they were shooting. Maybe it appears they could have been could have been back there shooting outward, or it's kind of hard to say. So they're going to gather up whatever evidence they have there and prepare to go to the next call. Guys, look like they're about finished up in here. Um, Bravo four five four. Can you just tell me if you mask got dispatch yet? Yes, and they started up uh, three minutes ago. All right, guys, we're gonna cut this one short and prepare for the next one. Until next time, guys, Nez Porter. Get you on the next one.